Welcome back. You're watching Maisha Prime News. My name is Rida Kering Chibet. And to kick us off is our education segment by Philip Simeo. Kenya is committed to become a newly industrialized nation by 2030 and acknowledges that quality education is vital in achieving this vision. Establishment and upgrading of the learning facilities is among the strategies employed in Kenya's education sector. We have made uh, a milestone in uh, quite a number of areas. Uh, we have an ICT infrastructure uh, which has assisted our teachers to integrate uh, teaching and learning, uh, ICT into teaching and learning. Uh, we also have a Wi-Fi connectivity and a CCTV surveillance. Moist Bridge Boys in Lukian sub-county in Kakamega County is among the public secondary school that has benefited from this initiative. My name is uh, Mr. Langat Edwin. Uh, I came to this school uh, in the year uh, 2017 December at uh, the first uh, group of the uh, localization. So, so our school is a sub-county uh, day uh, boarding uh, boys uh, secondary school uh, situated in uh, Senoko uh, Ward, uh, Lequiani North, uh, Som, uh, Lequiani South County. Uh, currently, we have an enrollment of uh, 585 boys about uh, a day uh, boarding. We have enough uh, teaching staff. We have 25, 25 uh, teaching staff, 21 TSC teachers and uh, 4 uh, POM teachers. And also, uh, these uh, teaching staff are assisted by uh, 13 uh, teaching staff. How about I'm uh, um, um, deputy principal uh, St. Peter's Boys, Moist uh, Bridge. We want to welcome you to this uh, wonderful school. Our students have uh, embraced uh, self uh, discipline. They are doing their own things without being directed so much. We only direct them on one or two things, but majorly the discipline they are directing themselves. focused in becoming the education center in the region. On the side of our performance, uh, we have been doing uh, very well. Uh, since I came, uh, the mean score was uh, 3.7 and it rose uh, to 5.04 uh, in the year 2021. 20, uh, and uh, because of uh, the good display that we have had, uh, we have had again tremendous improvement in uh, uh, performance. Our uh, performance has been growing since uh, uh, 2016. It has been very growing. Up to last year, we had a mean score of 5.1. And uh, we are intended to move from there uh, to a further height as we endeavor to perform well in these exams. Uh, we believe that uh, these students are to be nurtured uh, for future, for careers, and we have a department that deals with careers. After my Form 4, I want to go to Jomo Kenyatta University and then uh, take a course where I'm under mass media and communication. Now, and my message to Form 4 is that uh, I will encourage them to put my efforts to uplift the grade of our school and make sure that our school is seen in the, in the rank of the, our country, Kenya. The school also shines in ball games, music, handball, among other sports activities. We have football, which majorly we use the primary field to practice. And uh, this year, because of the challenges, we did uh, perform uh, to the expected standard. But this uh, next year we have already started and we believe we are, we are aiming at the 
uh, the county and even at regional, uh, in God gives us the grace. Uh, we also have volleyball, we have the indoor games, racket games, that is badminton and, uh, and table tennis. And uh, we are in the process of starting handball, uh, which is just uh, uh, in the initial stages. Uh, our endeavor is to be able to broaden the, uh, the games and sports uh, disciplines so that every student can get a chance to be able to, uh, to, be able to do one of the games that we actually are be able uh, to bring on the floor. Uh, we are also having uh, some students who are talented in uh, uh, drama, music, majorly arts. Uh, we have those departments. Uh, although we have not ventured in so much, we do talent show, but because of the expenses involved we we have not ventured but i know when we shall be able to have uh, funds to be able to fund our students i'm sure we're going to go uh, far because our students are talented in those uh, disciplines the school enjoys the support from west bridge community and the national government uh, we enjoy a good relationship with uh, with, the, uh, with our stakeholders we have a, a, a valid uh, POM that I know this who are very supportive. We also have uh, a good relationship with our area MP, uh, our, our former area MP, and I think uh, maybe the current area MP will also uh, maybe join in to support us. So the, the CDF has assisted us in many areas in terms of infrastructure. Uh, they constructed for us the dining hall, uh, which has a capacity of 1,200 students. Uh, they, uh, they also assisted us uh, to purchase a school bus uh, with a capacity of uh, 51 uh, students, uh, uh, a capacity of 51. And also they have uh, constructed for us uh, three modern classrooms. Uh, we also enjoy a uh, good relationship with the immediate uh, community, that is our parents and the neighbors. And uh, once in a while, uh, we, we, we assist one another. We assist one another on uh, terms of our corporate social responsibility. Uh, we avail our bus uh, to be used by the community. Education segment, Masha Television, I'm Philip Simeon.